Hi, I'm Chris. I've never been on an overseas holiday and I want to change that. So let's go food delivery driving with DoorDash and Uber Eats and see if this can pay for an international trip. I hope you like today's upload of The Road to Thailand. Excellent. What's up, guys? Welcome back to possibly the last episode of Earning Money on the Road to Thailand. I'm excited. This could be the night. We are so close. We are on the 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 the, the last little bit, the last few stip, steps, steps, steps. What am I, New Zealand? Steps, bro. <laughs> the last few steps on the road to Thailand. Just trying to get across that finish line. Um, just getting ready for a night run. Uh, there was a bit of a kerfuffle around the, the gated community that I live in today. Uh, someone found a mobile phone out the front and every single person who lives here has turned into like a detective of some kind, just trying to find out who owns the mobile phone. Uh, blessings of living with a, a lot of older people in a community. Um, and naturally, they all kept coming up to me because I got like sleeves of tattoos and the cover on the phone was a Black, Sev like a Black Sabbath case on it. And they're like, oh, he's got tattoos, it must be him. And they all just keep coming up to me. Oh, excuse me, Chris, um, did you lose your mobile phone? I'm like, no, I did not lose my mobile phone. So, um, I'm not sure how that's panned out. I'm not sure how that arc and saga has ended. Um, there's still elderly people walking around trying to find the owner of a mobile phone with a Black Sabbath case on it. It's amazing. They have all the time in the world. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have that much spare time to <laughs> join them on that. But anyway, Thai word of the day. Um, actually, let's just play out what we've got left. I've got... Oh, hang on, only two. Um, it was blank. And I got this one. Did few, did did me in the past predict that there this would be the last night? Is this a sign that this is the last night? Because there's only one left. Okay, we have got this one. This is our last one. Oh, this, this has got to be a sign, bro. This has got to be the last night. How did I get that right? That's weird. Hong Nam Yu Tini. Where is the toilet? <laughs> Hong Nam Yu Tini. Where is the toilet? <laughs> oh no. I hope I don't have to use that one uh, in an emergency. <laughs> if I get that wrong, that could be disastrous. Oh no. Uh, Hong Nam Yu Tini. We'll need to remember that though. I have heard horrors of Thai belly over there um, for us Westerners, but I've eaten plenty of Thai food in the past. I'm sure I'm going to be fine. My nickname when I was in university was Iron Gut because I would eat pretty much anything. And even to this day, I microwave so much food that people are like, bro, you can't just microwave food and eat it like that. I'm like, I'm like yeah, I can, bro. I'm conditioned to live like this. So I'm not scared of Thai belly, but <laughs> Hong Nam Yu Ti Ni, just in case, who knows. Um, Cool. Anyway, um, out multi-apping tonight. We're going to try to take whatever we can. We're, we're going to have a run at this. We're going to try hit the last little bit we need to hit. We're trying to get over that finish line so we can go to Thailand. So, fingers crossed. Wish me luck, guys. Let's go. Call me Star-Lord because this Chris is full mercenary mode tonight. We are working for Uber Eats and DoorDash tonight and we're going to take through whatever the strongest contract offer is. So let's lock and load and see how much we can make on this trip through the galaxy. Um, Guardians of the Galaxy reference, guys, just in case you didn't know. See you, mate. You too. Hey, I'm good. Uh, I'm just got an Uber Eats pickup for Sarah H when that's yep. ready. Right now. Thank you. How's that? That's good timing, isn't it? It is. Perfect. Thank you. Right you too. Hey, I'll just pop these pizzas down here. Thank you. No worries. And I'll just take a photo to say that it's been received. I already know. Oh, good. You have a good one. Bye. Bye. Hey, bro. Uh, I got an Uber East for Isabella V. Isabella V. Oh, you got files. Come on. We've got every time this shit everywhere, and then they don't fucking send it. When I'm on time, it's never here. Oh, <laughs> but but fuck, everyone else just sits around. Three other DD orders sitting there. Uh, that's nuts, bro. And I've clicked you on the app. Yeah, yeah. But no. No. Oh, at least I'm here. <laughs> 
Bro, how rough was that? Over at Sneaky Barons, man, there was like four DoorDash orders stacked up. And the food there is really good, man. So like, it, it is a shame to see that going cold. I, I know they did have a heat lamp over the top, but even still, four bags of DoorDash, I come zooming in on Uber Eats and just fucking clean up. I just had to wait like a minute, literally, uh, and they had it good for me. Um, but so that was sweet um, for me on picking up, but still them DoorDash orders, they are stacked up and ready to go. What are the DoorDash drivers in the zone doing tonight? Right now I'm out of zone. I've, I've been shot out of zone, so, uh, but Uber's been feeding me, like feeding me, like as soon as I'm dropping off an order, Uber's already on top of me, like a minute before drop off, saying, here's another one, here's another one. So they're keeping me going. Uh, now, DoorDash on the other hand, because I'm out of zone, I can't log in and take an offer from DoorDash, but I don't need to right now. If Uber keeps feeding me like a minute or two before drop-off, I don't need to log back into DoorDash and jump into jump into the zone. I had a look, everything is very busy. Uh, look at this. Um, add to route. No, no, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing add to route orders. I'm not chasing quests. I don't need to do it. Watch that. Watch that fucking time out. Nah, can't do it. And that one. I'm on an order across to Guzman E. Gomez right now, so I'm gonna I'm gonna clean up that order. But dude, just a shame at Sneaky Barrow, man. Just an absolute shame. Travesty even. We we're bouncing backwards and forwards between Uber Eats and DoorDash, but the orders were coming through relatively steady. So far across the night, no major hiccups, no major speed bumps. We we're running pretty cruisy. <laughs> Hey guys, um, got two Uber Eats pickups, one for Rochelle, one for Wayne. Wayne. Oh yeah, dude, that'd be awesome. Legendary man, have a good one. Bro, I'm starting to get worried that I'm not going to hit it tonight. I don't think I'm going to make it tonight. It, it's it's just died. It has just fallen off a cliff in busyness to to nothing. It's dead. So, like, check this out. Um, logged into, uh, yeah, logged into Uber Eats, but with DoorDash, the entire place man is grayed out. So I was out of zone. I came back into zone. Um, I've lost it. I, I need to be able to jump back in. Uh, to do it so i'm look dude i'm gonna abuse the open schedule for a bit um so 8 30 till fucking midnight i don't care let's go so in two minutes um because i'm booked in at 8 30 in two minutes i'll be able to jump in and dash because you can dash 15 minutes before you schedule so i'm just trying to get orders and uber's looking for orders right now so it's churning it's trying to find me a trip uh and in two minutes uh, DoorDash, I'll start looking for a trip with that. I'll be able to log straight in. But it's just rough, man. Like, I was hoping the night would just be back to back solid, but it's dying, it's slowing off, and yeah, I may not be able to hit it tonight. I might have to do one more shift. Let's see. Let's, let's try grinding out, though. Let's let's try commit to this. Let's try get it done. I just really wanted, I just wanted to not to be the one. I don't have any more flashcards. I can't do Toy Word of the Day. It has to be tonight. It has to. Just has to pan out that way. Don't have any more flashcards for Tywell today, so oh, I wouldn't even know how to start another episode tomorrow. What do I do? I just go, hello, I'm Chris, trying to go to Thailand. I, I, I need Tywell of the day. It's, it, it doesn't make any sense without it. Come on, I just need more orders. Come on. <laughs> I know, five, six more orders. Come on. It, it, it just, uh, I'm losing it, bro. I'm losing it. I'm losing it. And unfortunately, all good things come to an end. The night started to drag on and the orders started to dry up. Hmm, okoli dokoli. So, couldn't quite get there tonight. I've just hit nine o'clock uh, and now it's just turning into a graveyard. Haven't had an order for like 20 minutes. I've just been waiting it out with Uber and DoorDash, just cycling, looking for offers, not getting anything. Uh, and just from my experience, as soon as I'm nine o'clock onwards in the areas that I work in, it just dies off. Everything falls off a cliff. Um, so I'm at that point. So I've got to call it. Got to call it, unfortunately. Uh, which means that tonight I did not reach the goal to get to Thailand. Which means that um, tomorrow morning, I'm just going to get up tomorrow morning and just belt out a couple of orders. Just get her done. Um, just use that mentality. Like, get it done, mate. Get up early. Get it done. Just belt out a few orders. Get the rest of this goal cleaned up. And and, and then and then we can celebrate. Um, yeah. But... Okay, that's cool. <laughs> it's not the plan. The plan was to do a big finale tonight. I'd be like, you, and we're done. 
But no, unfortunately things don't always pan out the way you want, but that, that's okay. But positively, we still had a good night. Uh, we, we, we did well. We made over 100 bucks. That's, that's sick. That's solid. That's a good run. And we made progress. We, we still made progress, which is good. So, um, we're going to call it there, we're going to wrap it up tonight. Uh, if you're interested in delivery driving, links down below in the description to become a delivery driver. <laughs> just nagged. I'm nagged, bro. I'm so nagged. I was like, oh, I really want to do it tonight, but that's alright, that's alright. Uh, tomorrow, we'll do it. And I'll see you guys bright and early tomorrow morning. Peace.